Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Juan. I'm now a third semester nursing student at Imperial Valley College. And for today's video, it's gonna be how to be more consistent in less than five minutes. So it's only gonna be one tip or one thing you need to do. It's completely free because I know you have it in your house. And this, I got it from this book called Can't Hurt Me. I'm gonna leave it in the description, the Kindle link where you guys can buy it. I like to read electronic books since I find it easier because I'm in bed and I don't wanna have like my lights on. So yeah, now the whole concept about this video is gonna be having an accountability mirror. It could be a mirror in your bedroom, restroom, wherever you want, as long as it's like an actual mirror, not like the makeup mirror that's too small. Um, and I want you to put a post-it on it or a sheet of paper, uh, write it, print it, however, just write accountability mirror. And the whole thing of that, about that is that you're gonna be looking yourself into the eyes and say how you're feeling. It could be something positive, it could be negative, pep talk, whatever you want. But the whole thing of that is that you're looking yourself into the eyes and you're asking yourself, you know, what is wrong with you? <laughs> you know, if you're lacking motivation, if you're lacking progress, you know, just looking at yourself, be like, what are you doing with yourself? Or you, you know how to talk to yourself. Um, some people are nicer to each other, some people are meaner, because that's like how some people need to be talked into. I'm one of those people, like you really cannot talk to me in a nice way when I'm messing around. You really need to be like bluntly honest, be like, what the hell are you doing? Things like that. So for me, when I read that at the beginning, I was like, I mean, what difference is that compared to just me, I don't know, just driving and, and thinking about it. And what I found out is that like, when you look at yourself into the eyes, it gives you a different vibe. It gives you, I don't know how to explain it because I feel like whenever I'm driving or I'm just thinking about it, about my lack of progress or whatever I'm trying to fight into, I feel I can kind of like lie to myself in a way, kind of like cover it up. But when I look at myself into the eyes in the mirror, it feels different. It feels like I really, like I'm looking at myself. It's like, are you gonna lie to yourself in front of yourself? <laughs> that sounds a little bit weird, but it, it definitely does change. I definitely, made a lot of changes since I started doing the accountability mirror and for me I prefer to have it in my bedroom because whenever I'm lacking I don't know instead of doing some progress on my website or um, replying to some of my uh, friends on messenger or you know anything I have on my agenda whenever I'm lacking I know I have my mirror right here and I have to pass, pass there whenever I want to go to the restroom eat whatever and I have to look at myself and I can just like look at me in the mirror and be like yeah I get it it's like ah. or whenever I don't feel I want to do something I think about like I'm gonna have to look at myself in the mirror and I know I'm gonna be pissed off and things like that so I should just do it right now so that's the take that I have and that has really have done wonders with me just be completely honest and yeah that's pretty much it so the last thing I just want to say about a quote that he said on this book is that it really doesn't matter what other people say about you because you can just wash it off. You can be like, ah, whatever. Like, I don't really care about what you think. But when you say things to yourself, that's when it really hurts or like you, it really means something because you have to live with yourself every single second. So whenever you say something negative or positive, it's really gonna influence your behavior. So keep in mind with that whenever you're in the mirror and yeah, that's pretty much it. So if you guys stood here until the end of this video, thank you so much guys for watching and I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye-bye.